Hey, I'm finally doing another episode of, Hey, did you know you could do this? In Ham Radio Deluxe. So join me as I look at some free stuff that you can do with Ham Radio Deluxe. It's really cool. I'm Mike, Whiskey Alpha 9, Papa India Echo with Ham Radio Deluxe. If you find this video useful, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell. So in part, this is for all the DXers out there. And um, my daughter would refer to this as the Relax Fit episode. Um, giving a shout out to last podcast on the left. But there are some things that you can do in Ham Radio Deluxe version 6.8, which is the currently published version. And it's only going to get better in 6.9. Um, I'll talk about that in, in some subsequent videos. But one of the things I discovered lately, which I think is really cool, that I wanted to show everybody in case uh, you might want to use it. So we're all hunting something, right? So if I go and look at my awards tracking in DXCC, you know, basically I only need four more countries mixed. Um, I'm down to like, you know, 30 or less than 30 on um, phone and CW or so. I've got 2,668 mixed countries worked. I need 26 QSLs. So the point here is, is that as new DX comes online um, and they're spotted, the real key to being successful at landing the new country is to get there before the pilot builds up, right? So you got to be quick to beat them at the punch. And uh, one of the ways you do that in Ham Radio Deluxe logbook is to set up the alarm. So I'm going to show the work status indicator alarms. You could use alarms, but I would just say that if you use the alarms, you have to build up lists of wanted countries or whatever. And with the version 6.8 we did a few years back, you don't need to do that anymore. You just click band or mode for DXCC state and so on. So in the next version, there will be an at no column or kind of as your mixed column if you want. So I've got this set to go to email, right? So um, the challenge with that is though, is that Google and Yahoo and several other email providers decided they were going to lock down security recently over the course of the couple last couple of years. And they require either application passwords or you have to give access to lesser secure platforms and all that to use their email platform. So um, what I'm using here is something called SMTP to go. The cool thing about SMTP to go is that it's free. So you can send outbound email using SMTP to go. So let's pop that up and we can take a quick look at it. Hey, let me toss in a quick message. You need stuff and we want to help you find it. Go to amazon.com slash shop slash ham radio deluxe and you can find everything from interfaces for your radios, ICOM gear, Yesu gear, rotors, antennas, networking for home labels that work with our program. You can find station PCs. I get this question all the time. You can get a really beefy computer for under $330 that comes with Windows 11. Find us on amazon.com slash shop slash ham radio deluxe get the stuff you need now back to our video so here's the plans um, for smtp to go again it's just an outbound email server the cool thing is is that it's free so it's free for a thousand emails a month um, wow cool uh, i don't get five thousand text messages out of logbook anyway so that's the first thing is is that you know, and I don't get any royalties out of this, but if you want a good outbound email service that's not Google, Yahoo, or whatever, because maybe you're having trouble with getting the um, email alarms to work, then just go set up SMTP to go like I've got right here. All right. Then beyond that, um, Verizon. So down here you see uh, this note about... Um, you know, you can click this link here and it will take you to a page that shows you how to send an email to the text messaging address of your phone. 
So it's like phone number at vtext.com or phone number at txtatt.com or whatever it is in your country or location. So basically takes that email and sends it to your phone as a text message, which was great, except that Verizon and AT&T in the United States, and I think T-Mobile as well, they're doing away with all of that, um, what's called their email to uh, SMS gateway. Those things are all going away. So you've got to have some kind of a different solution for that, right? So one of the things I've found that I think is really cool is something called Pushover. And so Pushover is an application that you load on your phone. You can load it on your iPad. Um, it's outrageously you know, cheap. I mean, it's a, a $4.99 one-time purchase. Let me show some screenshots of what that application actually looks like when Ham Radio Deluxe sends a text message. So first of all, and these are just screenshots, but this is the main screen from my iPhone. So you see this pushover app here, which is basically doing the same thing that the text messaging app is doing. Um, you can see there's a one there, meaning that I have one message to look at, um, you know, from pushover that came through um, SMTP to go from HRD logbook. So when you get it on your phone, it's going to look like this. Um, when you open the app, it's going to tell you, you know, what the DX was, what the call sign was, you know, when they were spotted, you know, the time was at, you know, 1837 Zulu, who spotted them. I mean, this is cool. So basically, you know, for $5 for an app on your phone, you can, and a and free email service, you can basically set this up so you can go and work somebody. Um, you're notified. And look, here's this last one up here, PZ5RA. I was notified at 1837. At 1840, I've got them in the log. Isn't that crazy? So, I mean, don't miss any new ones. And I need all the ones I can get at this point. Don't miss any new ones. But um, consider using Pushover. I'm going to put them back up on the screen here again for a moment. Pushover, that's the mobile app. It also runs on an iPad. You can also log in and you can see these things on your on a browser. But if I'm sitting at a browser, I'm going to be seeing HRD um, Logbooks DX cluster anyway. But um, this is free. The email service is free. And um, it's pretty cool. So don't miss the new DX that you need when they're spotted on the air. Beat all the rest of us to the punch and get that station in your log. I'm Mike, Whiskey Alpha 9, Papa India Echo from Ham Radio Deluxe. Good DXing.